What's up everyone, Jeff here back again for Modders Inc. Today we're going to be taking a look at the NHL12S from Noctua. In an era of AIOs on everything, air coolers seem to slip through the cracks sometimes. But for small form factor and home theater PCs, they're usually the only option that will actually fit. Home theater PCs especially also come with a sometimes unexpected requirement for cooling. They have to be quiet enough so your wife doesn't care that you have a PC in your living room. To recreate our home theater PC, I've got a Ryzen 2400G running in an Inwin 301 Micro ATX case. While there are 320mm fans in this case, the airflow is more restricted than normal and it's exactly the sleek and elegant look you'd want in a home theater PC. If you'd like to see a review of this case, go ahead and click the card right up here. I'll be pitting the NHL12S against the stock AMD Wraith Stealth, which is included in the 2400G. I'll be testing at both stock and overclocked speeds with stock fan curves. Is the Noctua enough of an upgrade in both heat and noise reduction to justify a $50 price point over the stock AMD cooler? Well, let's find out. First, taking a look at what's inside the box, it comes with mount adapters for nearly every socket over the last 10 years. Sorry X58 fans, 1366 is not included. Instructions are well laid out with all parts very well labeled to avoid confusion when installing. Although I did manage to put the brackets on backwards the first time around. Also included in the box is a 4-pin Y cable for syncing your CPU fan with another case fan, a syringe of NTH1 thermal compound, a low noise fan speed reducer, and a nice long Philips number 2 driver. Installation was a breeze on AMD. The brackets attach to the stock AMD backplate and secure very easily to the heatsink with just two screws. The fan can be mounted on either side of the heatsink as well depending on your needs. I wound up needing to install the fan on the top as it contacted my G-Skill memory in the other position. Taking a look at our stock speed comparisons, the Wraith Stealth idles at around 43 degrees Celsius with full synthetic load bringing that up to 71. Fan speeds also ramped up considerably on the Wraith hitting 1700 RPM and getting moderately louder in the process. Even at idle, it was hovering around 900 RPM and speeding up a bit at very slight increases in workload, like Windows trying to download updates while I'm testing again. Moving over to the NHL12S, we see a 7 degrees Celsius reduction in idle temperature and a whopping 13 degrees Celsius cooler under load, topping out at just 50 AC. The more dramatic difference here was actually the fan speed. At idle, it sat at just 300 RPM without the ups and downs observed on the Wraith. The Noctua also only had to spend to 900 RPM to keep our 2400G at 58 degrees Celsius under full load. Overclocking the 2400G to 3.95 GHz at 1.40 volts, we see the Wraith's idle temperature shoot all the way up to 60 degrees Celsius, with the fan spinning at 1150 RPM. Even idle, the fan was audible from across the room, and certainly not something I'd want to listen to in my living room. Under load, it managed to keep the temps acceptable at 74 degrees, but spinning at its maxed out 1850 RPM to hold that. The NHL12S again impresses for both thermals and noise here. Idle temps matched its stock speed at 36 degrees Celsius, and that was only at 300 RPM. Full load only increased 6 degrees Celsius from 58 to 64, and that was at 1050 RPM. And the really cool thing is from idle to full load, there was no noticeable noise increase sitting right next to the case. So I asked, was it worth 50 of your dollars to upgrade from the Stockwraith Stealth to the NHL12S? Well, if temperature is your only concern, I'd actually say no. Both performed reasonably well, and you have to remember they're both rated at 65 watt TDP. They had no problems cooling off the 2400G, even when overclocked. However, if you're looking for a near silent operation and a happier marriage, I would definitely recommend the NHL12S for your next PC build. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to see more reviews just like this one. Check out our Amazon store down in the video description for anything you need for your next build or upgrade, including the Noctua NHL12S or the AMD Ryzen 5 2400G. Thank you everyone for watching. As always, I'm Jeff, and I will see you in the next video.